YouTube uh, very excited today I went out and grabbed myself a microphone from the source I got tired of waiting from the for the one online anyway so I hope the sound is much better than it has been since the beginning of this channel now uh, first of all I'm going to address the second question here that Nigel Bo asked any chance of getting a tutorial on floor and wall perlite installation now it will make it easier for me if you can google what you wanna see like uh, like a real life picture or something and I can put it in uh, in a video compile it for you and show you how to do it in advance still but otherwise I'll just shoot in the dark I might get the right I might make the wrong video uh, I don't know is it timber perlins or steel perlins I'm hoping it's steel perlins because after all this is advanced steel anyway first question was how is having trouble connecting a tube to a, a column now the tube is round hollow and the column is uh, basically I channel or I'm uh, sorry I I section or universal column depending on where you are you call it whichever way but he wants to connect this on the web not the not the flange of the uh, universal column now I'm gonna address that right now okay one minute deep not bad uh, I took the liberty of course as usual I drew uh, our pre preliminary structure and I took also the liberty to favorite this channel and as you can see there on the picture that shows it on the flange but he wants it on the web now uh, first you're gonna create the actual connection so main right click secondary right click and as you can see automatically it just kind of floats at the edge of the flange which is not good that's not gonna work it's not gonna hold so to do that we're going to go to shear plate and basically this is uh, this is just a, a properties play it's not the connection is wrong it's just the play on the property so uh, you want to go to gusset plate one of course which is that main one that main one there and uh, you can see it's off the web by some distance so what you want to do is take the distance from there to there so it's 4 and 13 16 and then going oh, crap. going to the properties gusset plate 1 and I believe it's the cutback you go minus 4 and you can use negative numbers to go the other way that's that's the important part minus 4 and 13 16 and like magic boom the plate goes back a little bit and as far back as the web now of course this is not connected there so you know you play around with a uh, couple others uh, other let's check make that zero end distance uh, uh, play around with a couple other options in here and you will get what you're looking for okay let's see what else can I change here uh, oh I guess that one there, that's there. so okay we'll just take that as two no four uh, that's not the right uh, that's not the right property there and distance uh, two okay we have it now we have you right now minus three there we go and then uh, you start uh, you know manipulating all these things until you get finally what exactly 
you are looking for in the connection and then these ones are obviously this, the, the secondary plate uh, and uh, you know you can do the same until you achieve the connection that you are looking for so go on the side view it looks something like that and you have seen we have reached the web and uh, once again I do thank you for your support uh, keep propping up my channel if you can you know by sharing liking commenting or doing anything else and uh, I will continue to pump out these videos to help you guys better your skills become gurus like I have become and uh, YouTube <laughs>